Hey everyone, welcome yet again to another Target Tuesday vlog. Gorgeous day to go Blu-ray hunting. It's about 75 degrees, so I'm looking forward. As you remember, last week was quite uneventful, but this week, I'm hoping it's gonna be much better. The big new releases, Mulan, live action and animation, as well as Bill and Ted 3 Face the Music. So let's get going. We're going to Best Buy, we're going to Target. So come on and join me. And I'm gonna start shopping for my Christmas decorations for my room. Very exciting. So what are we waiting for? Let's go. All right, so as I'm looking, we're doing a little bit better than we were last week. We have a couple of new things. So the first thing I'm noticing is Game of Thrones Complete Collection, the 4K. I believe the one I showed you last week was just a regular Blu-ray. So this is a 4K for $209. A little steep for me. I've never seen it, so I'm not going to get it, but it is here. And this is all new, new, or old, old, sorry, old, old, old. But we do have Antebellum. This came out last week. I didn't see it here. I'm not even sure if it was here. I, it might have been. I don't know. I was kind of angry last week so i might have glossed it over but they do have kick ass they do have kick ass i've never seen this not sure if i want to get it but it is only 19.99 so that is a possibility might down here we do have some christmas things we have die hard who considers die hard a christmas movie i know a lot of you out there do i personally don't and then we have the Polar Express. And then we do have one Jim Carrey steelbook, The Grinch Stole Christmas. <sighs> I don't know. I'm not like super crazy about this, but it is a steelbook. It's what, $27.99, $22.99, I don't know. I don't know, what do you guys think? Should I get this, should I not get this? I'm not sure what I'm gonna do yet. And then on this side, on the other side, here are all the ones that were missing last week that I was looking for. So we do have the Equalizer, Equalizer 2, I already have Jaws, Knives Out Steelbook, we have one Venom, Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse, Spider-Man Far From Home, Spider-Man Homecoming, one Once Upon a Time in Hollywood, really really wanted this one however it might have already been delivered to my house already and then we also have midway i think that is the end of the steel books but yeah they at least do have them in here so that is good to know but no bill and ted or mulan let's head to the other blu-ray section and see what they got so we're in the regular blu-ray section in the back of the store they still have these two Rambo sets. I can't even believe it. Uh, no one can afford the uh, $95, I guess. That's why they're still here. However, good news. I don't know if Best Buy is one is running a week behind or something because they pretty much have all the steel books I was looking for last week here, but no Bill and Ted or Mulan. I'm looking around and I'm not seeing it anywhere. So I guarantee next week they're going to have it. So here is Forrest Gump. I guess we're just gonna run a week behind. Here's Forrest Gump on Steelbook, classic with the feather, love that. Then we have Grease, whoop. <laughs> then we have Grease, total classic movie. It's pink, Olivia Newton-John, John Travolta. That's a classic film right there. And then we have Bumblebee. This is the one that I wanted so much last week. They didn't have it. This week, they have what, four copies. But I might have some packages at my house that I'll be opening later, hint, hint, so stay tuned till the end of the video. So those are the things that I was looking for last week that are here, but I still can't believe no Bill and Ted or Mulan. If you're looking for Christmas movies, come to Best Buy. <laughs> this was not here last week. They stocked it for this week. This is awesome. I'm actually gonna pick up a few titles because I don't really have a lot of Christmas movies in my collection, uh, surprisingly enough, but we got A Bad Mom's Christmas. I'm probably gonna pick that one up. And a bunch of others. What is Black Christmas doing in here? That's a horror movie. It's not, it's not a Christmas movie. But they do have the Animated Grinch, the Jim Carrey Grinch, the Daddy's Home Collection 1 and 2. True, that are, those are Christmas movies. I forget about that. But they do have a lot in stock here. Love Actually, Last Christmas. And if you continue to go all the way around, 
Again, we have Jim Carrey with the Nightmare, uh, Nightmare Before Christmas. I can't talk today. A Christmas Carol. We have Mickey's Once Upon a Christmas, Mickey's Twice Upon a Christmas, Mickey's Christmas Carol. That is the one I grew up watching, so that's very nostalgic for me. And then, of course, the Santa Claus and the Nightmare Before Christmas. So there are Christmas options. And of course, A Christmas Story and Christmas Vacation, Elf, the obvious favorites. Sometimes Best Buy gives and sometimes they don't. This week was definitely one of those giving weeks. Every single steel book that was out last week was there this week. And like I said, no Bill and Ted or Mulan, so most likely next week we'll see those titles. However, when we go to Target, we will most likely see those, except for Steelbook, but I'm not interested in Mulan on Steelbook anyway, when I can just watch it on Disney Plus. Because live action, we heard, wasn't that great anyway. All right, what are we waiting for? Let's go to the Target and see what we can find. All right. Here we go. We're going into Target. We're going into Target. Okay, so I was right. Target does have Mulan. There we go. They also have Bill and Ted, but you can't tell because the Black Friday Deals Now sign is covering it. But there it is. There's Bill and Ted face the music. But let's start with Mulan. Here is Target's gallery book. That's what it looks like. Then we have the 4K cover. Pretty cool. Gotta say, pretty cool. And then the Blu-ray has the image that we have seen, poster, everything. That is the typical Mulan stance. So that's on Blu-ray. And then same for the DVD cover as well. Now with Bill and Ted, if I can get it out here. There we go. So there is the Blu-ray. Bill and Ted face the music. And I believe it's the same for the DVD. Yes. But then they also have, if you don't have any of them, you can get three film collection for $29.99. So there's the three film collection. So Target does have Mulan and Bill and Ted, whereas Best Buy did not. All right, so I think that's all the new deals for Target. So I'm looking around in the steelbook section to see if anything is new. And I happen to see one thing, Dances with Wolves. And it is limited edition. 10,000 manufactured only. So this is a rare thing. So it's probably coming home with me today. But yeah, slowly but surely Target is getting in new steel books week after week. Is it just me or does it seem like my Funko Pop section is getting smaller and smaller? Like this is it <laughs> right here. But at least it's good to know that we have some new things. They're not new pops, but they're new to the store. They pretty much have all the Batman villains, Two-Face, Riddler, the Penguin, Mr. Freeze. I know Catwoman was here last week. Someone probably snagged her, but it seems like all the figurines are the new thing. So they're kind of taking over the Funko Pop section, but that's all right. It happens every once in a while. I'm still on the search for that Harley Quinn vinyl that matches up with that Joker that I got. This one, the Justice League thing. Still looking for that Harley Quinn. I don't know if I'm ever going to find her, but I'm on the search. I was just about to leave this section, and then I came across these, and I figured I'd show you guys. I don't know if these are brand new, but these are Avengers. Obviously, Captain America, Iron Man, Thanos, Thor, and you can see Captain Marvel back there. I guess they all connect. They all connect to make a scene, which I think is pretty cool. I know that Funko came out with a certain version of that, but this is maybe the off-brand <laughs> or the generic brand. I just figured I'd show you guys because anything Marvel is pretty cool. Ah, I'm looking around at trees. There we go. So my eye gravitated towards this one right here because it doesn't seem like it's too big and it'd be nice for my room. And then I look at the price, 115 No way. <laughs> That's way too much. But then this one right here, which is bigger and taller, is 40. Like, it literally makes no sense, but I don't want a tree that big for my room. I want a smaller one, so I don't know if Target is the place to buy it. Maybe I'm gonna try Walmart. Back at home, it's time for me to show you what I got when I went out today, and there's a lot. I'm warning you right now, grab a beverage and a snack maybe, because we're gonna be a little bit. I do also have some packages besides what I got when I went out today. I figure I would just incorporate, instead of doing a what's in the mail part two, just put it into the Target Tuesday video. We've got a lot to go over. 
So grab that popcorn and lay back and enjoy the ride. What did I get when I went out today? All right, let's start with Best Buy. They had everything today. As you saw, I could not even believe it. Kick ass. I almost said knives out. Kick ass. There we go. We've got kick ass. I've never seen this movie. I've heard a lot about it. People really tend to enjoy it. So car going by. My street is like a highway. All right. So I got kick ass. Very cool looking. I love the bright colors. I'm looking forward to watching it. Then we have Grease. I know I already have this. I'm going to tell you, there's a lot of duplicates in this haul. And you're going to be like, Susan, why did you get that? You already have it. It's a sickness, guys. It's a sickness. Okay, even though I already have it, it's a different case. So therefore, I have to get it. As someone said in the comments before, I'm a double dipper. Sometimes I'm a triple dipper. So I'm a double dipper in this case. We have Grease. I like the cover. I enjoyed the pink. Pink is one of my favorite colors. Just back off and leave me alone. And I did end up getting The Grinch, the Jim Carrey version. And I will have you know that it was a major surprise to me that it said $22.99. This ended up being $17.99. So that was a great deal for it, as well as Kick-Ass. It was listed for $19.99. $17.99. I think they're having special sales today or this week or something. So that's why I got a discount. If you have not gotten them and you want them, go online or go to your local Best Buy and take them up on those deals. Now, what Christmas movies did I get at Best Buy? Jingle All the Way. I know it is not my most favorite movie, but it's one of those unintentional holiday classics and it was for like $6.99 so I didn't mind getting this on blu-ray you gotta have blu-ray I got bad mom's Christmas again not the greatest movie but it's great for holiday time I don't have a lot of holiday movies I really don't know why so I'm trying to expand that so I picked up bad mom's Christmas and then last a Mickey's Christmas Carol this is so nostalgic for me because I grew up watching this every single year and I had to get it. I really, really did. I had to get this. Please let me know down below if you are the same way. If you are in this age range of 40, then you know Mickey's Christmas Carol and it's iconic. Okay, let's go over to Target. What did we get at Target? Bill and Ted 3. Susan, you didn't like Bill and Ted. Why did you get the third one? It's OCD and I'm crazy and I have to complete a franchise. So there we go. And I'm open-minded. Maybe I'll like this one. Maybe this will be my favorite one. Who knows? I don't want to miss out on something. And then as I showed you, Dances with Wolves Steelbook, only 10,000 copies made. You knew I was going to get this one. I mean, come on. This is, I've, I've actually never seen this. I've never seen this movie. Um, I think it's a pretty long movie. So when I have an extra three hours to kill, then during a snowstorm this year, I'll watch Dances with Wolves. Okay. Now let's get to the packages. And I'll have you know, there's two boxes and one of these one of these. However, I already opened the boxes, so we're not going to have an unpacking issue. Okay. I can't start this video over because I'm opening this right now. Live on camera. Bing. Woo. Ah, ooh, what did I get? Ooh, it's Venom. 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 Yes. Blu-ray so I could watch it. 4K Blu-ray and digital. Just look at that. That's freaking cool. <sighs> love it. Love it. So last week when it was the ultimate failure in the parking lot, when I left Best Buy, I went right online and pre-ordered or I ordered, ordered, ordered every single one that I was missing out on because I wasn't going to miss out on those sales. Oh no, no, no. $14.99. I was not going to miss out on those sales. So that is the reason why there's so many steelbooks that I ordered because for $14.99, oh, you betcha. I'm going to be getting those steelbooks. Now what's, look at this box. Okay. Look at the size of this. There's one, there's one thing in here. There's one thing in here. What do you think it is? <gasps> it's Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. Oh yes. Oh yes. I regretted not getting this steelbook. Look at it. It's hot. 
you've got the colors going on. You have the actors going on. And the back, you can't see it, but the dog is on the back. Reminds me of John Wick Parabellum Chapter 3. So I had to get that one. That was a no-brainer for me. Okay, now let's get to the box with six, seven. I don't know. I told you to get a snack. Okay. <laughs> First up, we got Knives Out. I missed out on this one when it initially came out, obviously. So I had to get the steelbook. Again, that $14.99 really sucks you in. Bumblebee. But then I just realized it's only a 4K. So I can't even watch it right now. This is why I have duplicate duplicate copies when I make stupid mistakes like that I can still watch my other one and when I upgrade to a 4k tv then I can watch it but I have it and that's all that matters next up okay I am not okay obviously I already kind of took a peek at these this might be the back I don't know okay so this is the equalizer too but there's no face of Denzel on it because at the Best Buy, the Best Buy, at Best Buy, when I showed it to you guys, it had Denzel's face on it. I think they packaged this wrong. I think this is the back because the indentation to open it is here. So you'd open it this way. So I think Denzel's face is on this side. But anyway, I got the equalizer too. And then of course, where's the other one? Equalizer which I've never seen. I've never seen this one. I have seen this one. I understood what was going on, but um, it's always good to have two. And they look different. I like the bright colors. You gotta love Denzel, okay? You gotta love Denzel. Into the Spider-Verse. Yes, I already have it. But who cares? Spider-Man Homecoming. This was my first steelbook it holds so many memories for me but this one has iron man on it so that's why i was like "Ooh, i want it and last but not least last but not least in this gigantic tuesday haul 1917 ah uh, this war movie changed my mind about watching war movies because before i've seen this War movies, I was like, eh, that's not really my thing. I'm not into it. I went and saw this in the theater with my parents, and I was absolutely blown away by it. So that kind of changed my way of thinking, of being more open-minded and watching different genres like horror, like war. Who knows? Maybe I'll get into westerns. You never know. But that is everything. That is the haul of everything that I got today. Let me know down below what did you get today? Did you get any steelbooks that you missed out on last week? Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.